Hi, this is Tapcat. Welcome back to Sid Meier's Civilization Beyond Earth. We have built our Emancipation Gate. Now I have to send a total of a thousand strength, military strength, through it. So there's another unit out the door. I think that's 80 total that we've sent through. So we have a long way to go. You can only move one unit through each turn. So, I mean, it is very limited, quite honestly. But um, nonetheless, I'm going to do it as fast as I can. I built another apostle. So next turn, we'll move this guy through. Uh, let's do nothing for now. Okay, so what shall I do next? We just basically need to find another tile to upgrade. I could easily come over here. Yeah, I'm going to do that because that was the tile I was working on when our war started and I had to abandon it. So over here, I think I'll just go ahead and start another one of these things. I'm pretty sure we have fought our last war. I just don't want to strip my military strength, you know, so badly through here that I make myself an inviting target. So what I am thinking we'll do is, um, you know, we'll keep building units and take them out. And I will get rid of some of my army, but I got to be careful about that. Because it would be very, very bad if I managed to get myself taken out. Um, as long as I'm doing this, for the science victory, just out of curiosity, what's it called? Transcendence? Sw research Swarm Intelligence. All right, I tell you what. Um, I ne Oh, wait, that's not even the right one, is it? Oh, God bless it. Okay. Stop. Think. Think. This is the one, I believe, for purity. Uh, I'm not sure. Crap. All right, I tell you what. I will research swarm intelligence, but... Oh, no. I remember now. Yeah, what the hell. It's only three turns. I'll just do it. We'll unlock what that thing says. Maybe we'll learn something. And I only need two turns to research my next apostle. They're worth about 50 each. What is it? 48? Yeah. So, doing those, it would take roughly 20 turns to get all the way. But I do have some stronger units I can feed it. I get really tired of those things. You know what? I don't appreciate it. So, suck it, you know? Okay, let's see if I can just... Uh, boom. Like that. And then, like that. And I think this guy can go. <laughs> I think my work up here is getting really close to being done. Okay, I'm going to take my promotion, finish this idiot off, and move on. And if any more of them act up, I'll just kill them. I don't think these things scale up at all, so they will not fare well if they want to play that game with me. Okay, so this guy... Yeah, we'll just bring him across. Okay, you come in here. Oh, crap. I could have gotten him out if I'd have known. But I didn't. It's not the end of the world. 
Have I got enough money? I can't tell. I could actually just buy a lot of military units. I am thinking about that. Like, how much would it cost to make whatever the strongest thing I've got is? I can't even do an, another angel until I get rid of something because they're worth 88. They cost a thousand each. That's actually what I need to do. I'm going to start buying angels because I can just buy them and get rid of them pretty much ev almost every other turn and it'll go a lot faster. So, okay. Tabcatopia. Uh, how long to... Oh, I can't build one. Duh. I just said that. Okay. I'm just, I'm literally stacked up here, man. Okay, back on it, my friend. Now can I go? Yeah, for obvious reasons, I'm not looking to, you know, make this as long a process as possible. Quite the opposite, really. Okay, that is done. Victory progress. So we did all that. Now we would have to do construct project mind flower. And I rather suspect that project mind flower, yeah, it requires a high degree of harmony. So fair enough. I mean, I that time I kind of did it knowingly. I wasn't in the dark. I'll go ahead and just take fabrication, I guess. Well, hold on. So I mentioned before, there's another, geez, which one is it? Is contact? No, that's not really it. There's one, and it's not domination. And it's not transcendence. All right. You know what? I take it back. Maybe there isn't one. Maybe what I was thinking of, it doesn't, it doesn't exist. Uh, I don't think it does. I think I remembered looking at transcendence and that you had to research three things. And I was thinking that was it, but that's not true. That just unlocked the project that you had to do. So fair enough. My bad. Let's upgrade this unit and stop wasting time. Plus 30% when attacking. Yeah, I'll do that. Didn't think. I should have gone the other way because I could have gotten a bonus when I was sending him through the gate, I think. Oh, well. Let's do this. And now, uh, of course, I can... Uh, just stack the next unit in there, ready to go. I just won't get the option because I already did one this turn. You know, if he's going to sit here, like, right up my butt. I don't like that. Okay, good. Okay, so now... I guess I won't really waste my time trying to um, do more. But this executor. Uh, that's not that's not what I thought it was. OK, never mind. Okay, Apostle, come on down. And you come on up. Probably will never get a chance to uh, 
you know, do anything, but whatever. It's all good. Sure. Okay. Um, hang on just a second here. My, uh, oh, where did I do that? That's ultrasonic fence. This is it. I just want to make sure this thing that I just started building. Yeah, it costs for Axite. I, I don't want that. So I guess what I'll do is I'll just put it into research. I don't think I really need to build more units there. I actually think I'm going to have a hard enough time soaking up all the ones that I do have, so. Or that I can make, is what I'm trying to say. Okay, um, so I finished this. I guess I was pretty close to finishing it before. I just didn't know it. Okay, I have a man inside. Let's get him out. And then let's get him in. Now, by the way, how close am I? I, I don't even know. Um, emancipation. I need another 750. So I'm a quarter of the way there. All right. I mean, you know, whatever, man. It's all good. Yep. Can't do anything with you yet. I actually think... Um... Let's go ahead and move this guy over. And I don't think it'll let me, but if it will, yeah, I was afraid of that. Okay, I have to wait. I got to get uh, my unit out of the city. But I want to... I want to start buying angels. I said I was going to do it, and then I kind of got absorbed in producing infinite apostles instead. But I, I want this done. A All right, that's done. <laughs> the orbit imminent. Yeah, I've been hearing that for a long friggin' time, and yet somehow I still have the stupid thing. Where's the one that lets me improve floatstone? I never did that. Um, yeah. Well, I could do this. It looks like I get another pick from here. We'll do that. So my health is up to 19. I get a free virtue. That's almost funny at this point. 25% more yields from your trade routes to your own cities. Holy crap. I got a lot of those, man. So we're, we're pretty much smoking. And... I mean, sure. I'll just do a wonder. We'll never finish it, but who cares? And then, um, over here, I think I'll just do the same thing. That's fine. At least then I don't have to screw around every few minutes. Okay, so, I need to get him in here. 
and then send him away and then get this guy out of the city do nothing let's get the trade vessel going to this city it should work nicely uh wait what's hold on now what i want to do is purchase it's going to be expensive but we're going to purchase the evolved angel 1390 energy but we have 8200 and it has 102 strength so i mean you know that's really really good and yeah now as for this i guess i'll just do mass driver sure okay i'll probably not even get this guy out of the gate but you know who cares and go ahead and build a terrascape Okay, so there's an executor here. Okay, do nothing this turn. Trade vessel, you may go to someplace good. This was my previous route, 10 and 13. I mean, that's really good, but this is better. No village was ever ruined by trees. Yeah, I don't care about your favors. I don't, truly. They are like, you know, whispers in the wind to me. Okay, another apostle. I'm actually... I'm not even going to try and move him because I just don't believe it's going to matter. Let me uh, let me try to sort out what I've already got going. So I have an angel. They move him out of the way. We'll move the angel in. And then we'll commit it. Now. This turn I can purchase another angel. So, see, I'm not even getting these guys through. Now, I may not have enough money to do this for literally everything. But I am down only needing 594. So, I need like six angels. If I were to do it, you know, all with them. Okay, I won't have enough money. But, I don't think it's going to take me too friggin' long. And I even, let's do this. So... This is an angel, and we're just going to move it over. That is actually kind of cool looking. Uh, okay. The apostle. Yeah, you just sit. I'm going to leave all the rest of these guys where they're at. Uh, okay. The sad thing is, I literally can't even tell what worker uh, okay way over here okay fair enough yep he's never <laughs> he's never gonna make it through that gate I'm afraid uh, all my wonders are taken I'll build an ultrasonic fence and here um, sure money we're actually pretty low on our, you know, output per turn. So. Xenomalium has been built by another colony. Oh, mercy. Well, the joke's on them because I have no idea what a Xenomalium is. So, suck it, nerd. <laughs> All right, there goes another one of them. 
Let's bring this guy up. And there we go. So now I'm going to buy another one, I guess. I could take a turn off. I mean, I have this guy to feed it, but I might as well just buy it. I mean, I don't see why not. Where are you? There you are. Well, at least I found a good use for my riches because, you know, I'm definitely shaving a lot of turns off of my uh, victory. So I'm very happy about that. Okay, I'll take range. We're not going to build one of these things anyway, so not really a thing. Peace Treaty expired. The funny thing is, I was just thinking how I would almost declare war just so I could watch the Angels fight, which, by the way, I'm not going to do. That would be pretty silly, even by my standards. But it would also be kind of funny, so that's why I was thinking about doing it. Um, yeah, we'll bring you in. And let me see... Can I actually get out without blocking the portal? I think what I'll do is um, I'll just move that one like where I know for a fact I can get all the way out next turn. I don't want to move him there and then he's blocking the portal. That's kind of the worst thing that can happen to me. I just waste that turn in effect. Uh, now we have two that I know I can just feed in there. So we're, you know, we're kind of past the point of having to worry about much of anything, I would say. Uh, yep, I'm, I'm good with that. And yeah, this guy, unfortunately, is just completely irrelevant. We do not need any more of the apostles. You know, I might as well even just move him there. And then next turn, he's just right where he needs to be. Okay, I just realized, I mean, I may have spoken a little too soon. Um, how many, how many points do I still have? I need 390. So that's going to get me down to like 290. This guy, I need two more. Yeah, I'm okay. Uh, even if I didn't have enough units as far as the angels go, and I think that I do... I would still have enough of these other guys left over to just get me over the top within a turn or two. So, um, actually, the bad thing though is I'm not going to be able to buy one more angel. So, I am going to have to do that, I think. I'm not sure what's going on. My energy has just been dropping, dropping, dropping. Oh, you know, I know why. Because I never rebought all of my cargo convoys and stuff when uh, we had that war a bunch of them got trashed and um, you know then the war ended and I just didn't think to replace them I was more focused again I'm just trying to end the game so that's fine it'll take me literally like one or two turns oh, more so, in terms of score, it looks like I'm at 1,043. The next best is 799. I don't think there's any question that I should have gone the next higher difficulty. 
I thought that there was enough new about this game, and I, I certainly demonstrated in ignorance of like the victory conditions and stuff like that. This was far from an optimized game, uh, but I feel like it also was not a close game, and we really crushed the competition. You know, if I had wanted to do more conquering, I could have done more conquering and uh, all of that. I just didn't, you know, it wasn't a priority for me. And um, so I might as well move him over because I do not have enough to buy that last one. If I had paid a little bit more attention, I could have done that, but... I'm not, I honestly, like, I'm just not all in a twist about it. Uh, so, yeah, but I should have gone for the second hardest. I presume that would supposedly be the equivalent of um, Immortal in uh, Civ Five, But I didn't. It's okay. And let's see. I'm just trying to... Get as much of this, so I don't really need food or production there anymore. Maybe I'll just take, yeah, like that. At least now I'm not negative in energy. I don't like that. I'm leet, though. Yeah, I, I kind of realized a long time ago that I was going to win this game, and that I could win it pretty much however I wanted to. And um, that really told me that I made a mistake and that I should have gone on the higher difficulty level, but I didn't know. I never played it. So um, I was tempted. So in that sense, like it kind of irritates me that I didn't do it. But I mean, you know, you don't know what you don't know, if that makes sense. So I finished that. Uh, well, I didn't mean to do that, but it doesn't matter. So I guess starting next turn, I'll be feeding this thing apostles. Uh, I think it's only going to take like a turn or something. Uh, actually, what if just to be safe, I do something like this. So like, give me like 15 energy... And I'll give you like 15 science or something. Yep. Okay. So all I'm trying to do there is um, see if, I guess it was stupid. I should have, I should have asked for <laughs> energy in a lump. I wasn't thinking, whatever. Let's just get in here. And then, what does that do for me? Uh, 30 so Okay. We win next turn. So, I'm just going to pick attack. And we'll go uh, money. Thank you. You go ahead and start another one of these. That Terrascape is really good, I think. Um, the only bad thing is, you know, you're not getting insane amounts of food, but in my book, at least getting two food, two production and two culture, that's really good. And then I haven't really used the satellites, but you can use different satellites. Like if you want more energy, they have one that does that. If you want more food, they have one that does that. So, I mean, you can, you can make it where it's even better. And combined with these trade convoys between your cities, pff, it's pretty grotesque. I mean, honestly, you could have a pretty good little juggernaut going. All right, I believe that this is going to be the end of the game. Uh, but I guess it won't trigger until... <laughs> until I click next turn. I don't know. 
At least I'll finally start construction on my first floatstone quarry. Um, right as the game is ending. Uh, I'm just literally picking these at random, by the way. So, just to be clear. I want to be quick. I just want to get this done. The video is already getting a little on the long side. So, no point making it longer. Oh, brother, I thought that was going to be my win message for a second. Achievement progress. There when is possible, no try. The opponent's advantage of ground must be negated. If you okay. Okay. Uh, what, is, what does this mean? Uh, did I not win? Oh, all right. My bad. I need 10 more. I need a time. All right, there we go. Those who welcomed us okay. and embraced the future we represented. There were those that rejected us, fleeing from our messengers, afraid of their own freedom and potential. This was our burden, the burden of those blessed with vision. And as technology does with all things, it will heal these wounds. It will quench the fire of this transformation. Liberated from their weaknesses, the people of Earth gaze upon their deliverers with new eyes and see us as we truly are. Heroes, prophets, the saviors of humankind. Okay, well that is the end of Beyond Earth. Uh, I certainly made my share of mistakes in the playthrough. I also made a mistake when I was setting up the game. I made a couple. I obviously should have gone up the next step in difficulty and also I, I left it on small map because it was the default and I was thinking that it may be in this game what what was called small was really you know what I would think of as standard and I was afraid that if I went to the next size up that the game would maybe become very very long right but um, what I think I forgot. I'm not 100% sure this is true, but I think small is the default on Civ 5 as well. Uh, when you initially install the game. The thing is, once you've played the game and you've set it up once, then it just defaults to whatever the last thing you picked was. And since I pretty much always play on standard, that's just what I'm used to seeing as the default on my computer. So... Uh, the fact that the, the small was default kind of threw me and made me think, you know, that was the norm. I don't think it really affected the result a whole lot, uh, especially for this kind of victory. Um, there would have just been another continent or two with civilizations that I probably wouldn't have really interacted with very much. It would have mattered a lot more if I was going for something like a um, domination victory. And uh, at any rate, I hope you enjoyed watching. I thank you for watching. And that's all for now.